Hello, welcome to Talented Developer. For latest update and notification please subscribe our YouTube channel. Hello guys. So first of all welcome everyone in Talented Developer. Here we are going to create a Stripe product. That means like step 1 using the Java Stripe API. So in previous video we have already created a product and we have also added the Stripe pricing plan but that was using the stripe dashboard here we are going to create using the java code so once we are going to create on that time first of all we need one stripe api key here i have entered my stripe key you have to enter your stripe key next one we have to give here object so we need one map okay that is key so in key try to give a string okay and here we need one object also and next one is keep the name so i'm just going to use pro duct param okay it will be a new hash map once you are done okay then i am going to just copy the name of the object so i no need to always type here next one just use put so inside put we need to keep the key so key here I am going to give the as a name. So what is here name? So if you remember in last video what we have done we have given some name. Name here is test product. So similarly here we will give some name. So I am going to give here name as a product one. So we give a name here and next one we have to use here type. So what is here type? So in last video we have discussed earlier a type can be service or goods. Goods means like it can be only one time and service means like it can be recurring. So I have entered two things. Now we can do we just need to use product then we have to use create. Next one we have to just enter the our object. So once you will run it will create the product but I need to see in console so how we can see you can see earlier I am using Google JSON so just I will use same thing to print here so just use pro duct p equal to this one so once it will run and it will create it will assign to this variable now I will just use s out that means like shortcut so here I am going to print this one p dot to json so I need to just save and I have to just run this program so once it will run it will take the name of product one it is a one service type and it will be here create and you can see in console it is showing id this name is a id that means like it has been created so just come and run this one once you will run here in dashboard you can see one product has been created with the name of product one here you can see also so just come you can see here it is created but there is no pricing in next video we will add what is how to add the pricing here so if we come this is one product and this is the product id so just come and see here this one is one id here you can see it is one is active so here what is active active is like whenever the product is currently available on that time it will show active so by default it will be active next one is attribute so it is one array it is a blank here you can add five alpha numeric also next one is caption null and uh, you can use here live mode so live mode you can see it is a false once it will be on production that means like you can give here as a true metadata metadata is a set of key value pair that you can attach to the product object so it is for you how you want to know what is your product what is the pricing plan it depends on you here you can see name name is on this one and here you can see type is a services here you need label if you remember in earlier video i have shown you like uh, one product you can define everything so that will becomes here and url is blank currently this, it is not deleted also so it will be null in next video we are going to see how we can retype this product and how we can 
delete and update so i'm just going to copy this one for our things and i'm going to paste this one thank you guys